kufika mbele ya kamati ya seneti ya afya akiangazia masuala ya ada zitakazotozwa katika bima mpya ya afya ya shif kikao hicho pia kinatarajiwa kugusia uainishaji wa ada hizo na huduma zinazotarajiwa kutolewa awali waziri huyo aliwahakishia aliwahakikishia wa Kenya uwazi na wajibikaji katika utekelezaji wa mfumo huu wa afya wa shif go.ke and then afyayangu.go.ke that's when you go now to the portal for registration we also noted that we have households that require assist assistance in registration and we are going to deploy the community health promoters to support us in that because we will be going right into the villages households uh, registering uh, members of the households and then we also have the sharp branches who will also be going out supporting uh, public members of the public to register and uh, will also deploy or have agents who will support us in registration now the other issue which members had raised here is the uh, how are we contributing to shift i think we talked uh, everybody is aware that all salaried employees which is in formal sector where they are known and they are, they have pay they are pay slip or they are in the payroll of that organization the employer will remit 2.75% of the gross salary of the employee the employer will remit 2.75% of the gross salary of the employee the non salaried that's in formal sector will also contribute 2.75% of their income as it will be determined by the means testing uh, tool that uh, honorable uh, members had asked we are going to arrive at their 2.75% uh, income after determining using the means testing tool and therefore they will get a message in their forms that you are supposed to remit that amount to sha so that you become a paid up member of sha we also take note and recognize that we have poor members and vulnerable members of our population and this they will also be subjected to the means testing and therefore that we shall arrive at the government subsidy programs <coughs> that we do have and therefore uh, for example the national level we shall through the social protection uh, ministry of uh, health for example through the linda mama program and other uh, programs that we have the 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 na muungano wa wabunge wanawake kiwopa wakiongozwa na naibu mwenyekiti